Okay, find the equation of the parabola with focus at 3, 4. Well, I'm going to draw a picture. And the picture is going to look like, let's see, 3, 4, so up here somewhere. And the directrix is the y-axis. So this is directrix over here. Now, what does that mean? It means I have the... Um, I have a vertex here. And this thing is gonna look like this over here. Again, this is the point three, four. This is x equals zero. And this point's dead center now. What's that point gonna be? Well, the y coordinate's certainly four. And this is a four there. Let me get my eraser out so it looks cleaner. And that vertex is the dead center between 0 and 3, which is 3 halves. All right, let's take a look at it. And before I do that, I want to write down um, the P. What's P going to be? It's going to be 3 halves. All right, let's write it down. What do you get? Let's take a look. Y minus 4 squared equals 4 times P. Well, the P is 3 halves, and then X minus 3 halves. Standard form of a parabola, by the way. Let's simplify a little tiny bit. Y minus 4 squared. Uh, 2 goes to 4 twice, so 6. X minus 3 halves. By the way, as far as I'm concerned, that's a good answer there. I'm going to go a little bit further than that. It's going to be Y squared minus 8Y plus 16. 6x, and that's going to give you minus 9. So if you want to, you can write down as y squared uh, minus 8x. Uh, let's take a look at that. I'm going to add 9 to both sides, so plus 25 equals 6x. All right, let's get a red pen out and see how we did. Uh, again, my claim is we should be seeing, uh, sorry about that, we should be seeing this somewhere, and I am. It's right over here. And we should be seeing a simplified form of it, and we're seeing that right over here. Thank you.